the theft module or anything other than the lock cylinder or the ignition key is going to need to be programmed on the previous system and also this PK3 system. Now, the reprogramming part of it, nothing real exotic. You're going to go in there, you're going to, let's say you're using a J2534 box. You're going to go in there, you're going to tell it the module that you want to program. You're going to have to know the VIN number. All of the stuff that you're accustomed to doing with programming modules is still going to be the same. You want to make sure that you don't have the battery so that it's going to drop in charge and this is just standard reprogramming 101 here because obviously if that ignition switch is drawing too many amps out of the out of the battery and the battery drops below a certain level you could in essence brick the module so make sure you have the approved um, battery maintainer hooked up to the vehicle so that you don't run into that kind of problem the pk3 systems one last thing that made them different is as soon as i stuck the blade part of the the key inside that lock cylinder, it, that exciter would want to get energized. So you, it's not uncommon, you know, maybe the customer's got an attached garage or whatever. It's not uncommon if they just leave their key inside that ignition lock cylinder that after about three days, that battery is dead because that whole time you're creating a parasitic drain on the battery. So if that's the case, you might want to just tell the customer, hey, do whatever you want with your keys, you know, but don't leave them inside the lock cylinder. You know, either take them in the house with you, put them in the center console, whatever the case happens to be. Just don't put the blade inside the actual key lock cylinder itself. All right, again, you can do the 30 minute relearn procedure just like we talked about on the other one. So keep that in mind. It's the exact same procedure, again, just to try to get as much material covered in this, in this class as possible. I want to save a little bit of time. So again, the procedures are the same. And also, the, all of these words that are on the screen can be found in your information systems or possibly you could probably even Google it at this point.